Is this the Krusty Krab? No, this is Patrick. Is this the Krusty Krab? No, this is Patrick. Why, hello, guys. It's been a while, hasn't it? <laughs> Listen, uh, as you can see, I'm playing Mario Odyssey. Do not laugh because this guy requested it. Shout out to Sammy Urai 7 for telling me to play Mario Odyssey. So shout out to you. you. Guys, got a game you want me to play next time I do one of these videos? Leave it in the comment section. You might get picked. So you probably clicked on this video because you're a mini clean viewer and you've just missed this guy's videos. This guy right here, you've loved him so much. You know what, guys? I missed you guys too. Or you probably watched this because you're curious. This is you right now. You'll be like, hmm, I wonder what this video is about. Mini Clin, what the heck Bruh. is this this time? Because you always be posting some crazy. Or you look like this. And uh, this is what I like to call your average Sneeko viewer. <laughs> or your Sneeko himself, because <laughs> Sneeko, if you are watching this, this video is on you. Ooh. We are going to make the a long awaited video I've been waiting to make, okay? So in 2022, 2023, you probably know this guy as um, one thing, and that is um, being an Andrew to the club. Or if you're very cultured and you've done your research, uh, you probably know him for this video. Yes. What? Yeah, Sneeko, I don't know if this is the one. Hey, call the But if you really, really do know Sneeko, you know he was a normal YouTuber that actually posted content, quality content. Yeah, it's actually kind of crazy. Um, Now, before you guys say Mini Clin, uh, you can't really talk about quality content. Yeah, I know, I don't make quality content. But this guy did. Um, if you guys watch some of his videos, um, you know what, actually, I'll put some of it here. Very well done. Now, I don't know what happened to this guy, Sneeko, but he has become one of the most annoying, cringiest people on the f internet. And I'm not over exaggerating when I say this. So when I first found out about this guy, I was like, you know what? Uh, this is like an Andrew Tate club, but then I dug deep. I dug deep and I was like, why did he stop making videos like how he used to? Is it because of Andrew Tate or is it because of his newfound modeling <laughs> career? I am literally a model. I've walked for Burberry and I was in Vogue. I've modeled. <laughs> Yo, Sneaker, where are you running to, my boy? <laughs> <laughs> like, bro is. <laughs> alright, yeah, alright, believable. To be honest, Nico, yeah, if you are a model man, can you please explain to me what the photo is right here, yeah! then? Because of this, and my boy, I know you ain't got. <laughs> How much did you get paid for this? It better be worth it. You know what I'm saying? Because at this point, what? Anyway, moving on. So I'm making this video to show you how annoying this guy is and how much of a hypocrite this man is because I'm tired of seeing this man on my timeline talking about some bullshit, Bruh. okay? Trying to be f Bruh. Andrew Tate. Now this Nico guy, the reason why I don't like him is because um, with Andrew Tate, there are some takes that kind of make sense, which is kind of surprising, yes. Um, but this guy, it's like, there is some things he says that is just openly, seems like it's meant for attention. And that's where we go to his Twitter. The next part of this video is where we go to Sneeko's Twitter. Uh, because I find his tweets f Bruh. amusing. It's actually hilarious. Like this tweet that says, Social media feminized the world forever. What does this even mean? Like, can we be honest? What does this mean? Even this guy, Leon Lush, in the reply said, Forever. Bro, social media has existed for a couple years in a world millions of years old. Just relax for fuck. Bruh. And the other guy below said, this be so dramatic. Like, I don't understand. I don't know if he's doing this on purpose or he actually is this. But then it gets worse. <laughs> it gets worse because this guy says, in the left picture, I was drunk. Bro. Like, actually, fuck it. I need to cue the SpongeBob sad music for this because I feel like this is very. No, actually, you know what? Not the sad music, the motivational one. In the left picture, I was drunk. Broke. On the right, I'm sober. Up 10 pounds and rich as f Bruh. Dude, your life will turn around with the right mindset. 2020, 2023, just start. This is only a month of fitness progress. Let's get to work, boys. And then he posted this photo. Um, 
we're July 22nd, 2022, February 2023. Uh, I, I don't know, bro. That's more than one month. I, I, I'm not going to lie. I'm not even trying to hate. Uh, I don't see any difference apart from sweat on you. And on top of that, you are having your arms out. In fact, I'm not the only one that agrees with this because the other guy in the replies says, looks the f***ing same, to be honest. <laughs> Bruh. I could already predict what this Sneeko guy would say if he watched this video. Wow, let's go look at Mini Clint. He's fat and stuff. Honestly, uh, Sneeko, I'm not gonna lie. I don't really like that. That kind of hurt my feelings. That's very fat phobic. You know what I'm saying? Like, we're not gonna get emotional for the video. But guys, if you want more proof that he's fat phobic against us, us fat people, look at this, guys. Wake up now. <laughs> okay. All jokes aside, I found this tweet so funny because it's like this guy is actually tweeting as if, as if nobody can be fat anymore. It's like. Fat people are always going to exist. Like, I don't understand what type of people watch this and his audience appeal to. You're never going to have a world where everyone is built like Arnold Schwarzenegger. It's never going to get to that point. Also, I just find it funny how the mannequins are fat to advertise, I don't know, man, a bigger size for men and this guy has an issue. What do you mean, wake up now? But what, what is that even? I walk into H&M tomorrow and I see a skinny person that isn't my size wearing a t-shirt. Huh? How am I going to know what it's going to be? To be honest, I think this is good because I would rather have it on a Bruh. fat mother Bruh. like me to see what the Bruh. it's going to look like without me trying it on. All right. I don't understand this shit, okay? I really don't. The tripod gym girls make me want to join. Like, th is he serious? You what? Like, I'm laughing, but it's just, it's so retarded, it makes me laugh. Like, now, if you guys don't know what the tripod gym girls are, I'm not gonna lie, they are annoying, but I'll just explain what they are. Basically, guys go to the gym, girls go to the gym, and girls assuming that um, that guys basically want to be interested in them, ask them on a date, maybe have a little, you know, saying bang, bang, boom, boom. Um, I do kind of agree with the tribe of guys being a prick, but joining a and Sneeko is kind of crazy. I'm not gonna lie. Like, like, why? Why, why? why was this even needed? As you guys can see, I've shown you a few tweets. These are tweets that are regular. Like, I'm talking about these are regularly posted. Like, he posts tweets a lot, which is quite ironic because the next tweet is, Rich people don't use social media for fun when, uh, I'm not gonna lie, for someone that claims you are a millionaire oh, now shit. as your pinned comment. I got you right where I want you, little nigga. Go ahead, say cheese. So why do you use social media so much? You clearly are having fun. Uh, and you're, you, trust me, you are because you tweet almost every single day some bullshit to quote unquote, maybe troll people, maybe get people mad. You're having fun with this. It's just ironic. Like, what was the point of this tweet? There are such things as content creators that probably make way more money than this Bruh. right here, considering you don't have a channel anymore and you're run fing rubble. Who's using. There are literal content creators that are making money, having fun every day what huh? is he talking about and this is coming from me if you talk for a living and haven't been cancelled yet you either are a woman or a bot i like you man you lie a lot <laughs> all right listen <laughs> like i don't know if he's trolling or not like he clearly isn't trolling all right and look at the views he gets for these tweets i like to talk shit once in a while but the reason why is not because we are women or a bot it's because I don't know, man. We're f not stupid. You, you idiot. Okay, you can try and wake up the internet as much as you want. Sneeko, okay? But let me tell you something, okay? It's never gonna f Bruh. The plan that you and Andrew Tate have to wake up the internet, oh, guys, it's never gonna work. You either adapt and cut down on shit that you really are going to say, or you get yourself banned. Because I talk on the internet, but you know what? I have limits. And that's coming from me, the person who doesn't really have a lot of limits. You're not very smart, are you? Now, I'm having fun reading these tweets because <laughs> the next tweet is stop playing video games, level up in life. <laughs> what does this even mean? Can we be honest? Because the last time I checked, video games made a lot of people level up in life. Okay, just because you see XQC sitting in his bedroom, not getting Bruh. sleep because he's streaming 24 hours. Let's give Corey X Kenshin, for example. Everyone loves Corey X Kenshin, right? Um, so what, guys? Are we just going to say he did level up in life? Because I'm not going to lie. This is what Corey X Kenshin used to fucking look like. I don't know. Bro thought he was opium or something. Like, what is it? <laughs> so I'm not going to lie. I would say level... Playing games kind of does level up in your life, Sneeko. <laughs> like, I'm not going to lie. This is the most I've laughed in the video, bro. I'm playing Bruh. Mario Odyssey shitting on a guy who... Bruh. 
uh, streams on Rumble. This, I, this is what I missed about making videos. Because you know what this next tweet says, bro? Are you really LGBTQ+, or do you have no other unique personality traits? <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't understand. Now listen, Sneaker, I don't know if this video is real. A lot of your viewers like to troll you because um, this video looks like you and <laughs> I can't show it, but I'm going to just show his face. This is a clone of you getting fucked. <laughs> so this just isn't hey, a good on, this ain't <laughs> Now, I don't know if this actually is Sneaker. It awfully looks like him. Hilarious, boys, when I saw this. Not only does this guy love cuties, that Bruh. weird our show. Not only is this guy a quote-unquote model. Uh, this is model, by the way. <laughs> Not only is this guy one of the smartest guys on the planet as you guys can see he refuses to lose and this is how we're gonna end the video because i found this hysterical one of my favorite tweets from sneaker boys 12th of january 2023 sneaker tweeted i am never watching Bruh. again you know what i respect it Sneeko. i respect it in fact um i kind of know why you don't <laughs> i kind of know why you don't watch Sneeko. Because um, your hidden replies tell you why. Um, why would you when you get to watch a girl get Bruh. by other guys for free? <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. What's this, Nico? Is there something I don't know about? I don't really know about this. Let me, let me go to the next guy who explained it. There's an interview where Sneeko tries to explain why watching his girlfriend have Bruh. other dudes is a good thing. What are these guys talking about? Shwaggy? <laughs> Shwaggy? You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm really confused, Sneeko, what they're talking about. So I go in the other replies and Kingstar, the man himself, the gnome, he uh, went in your replies and said, but you'll watch a girl. Never mind, that's too cold. So I'm confused. I'm still in hacker mode, guys. I'm still in, in deep diving, trying to investigate. And I found the video, Sneeko. I found the TikTok where you're talking to this guy and you say this. Oh, Sneeko watches his girl get Bruh. Where does that come from? Is that true and why? Okay, I have a closed, one-sided open relationship. I can Bruh. women, she can't. What? So I thought in order for it to be fair, like, let's go to a spray party. What um, but uh, I had his girl, he had mine. Sneeko, as the famous Drewski once said, what, what do, do you mean, mean by that? that? You don't watch porn Bruh. and you make your viewers think you're so, like, I don't know, pure. But you watch your girl get f Bruh. in the ass and take her to Bruh. parties, my boy. Correct me if I'm wrong, Sneeko, but I don't know, man. Unless I, there's something I don't know about. I don't remember Andrew Tate uh, watching his girlfriend get f Bruh. in the ass. I don't remember Andrew Tate becoming a quote-unquote model and wearing basically a man bra. So, Sneeko, I'm going to say this once. Are you really the next Andrew Tate? Are you sure you want to do this? Because last time I checked, you trying to be someone you're not got you banned and has now have become one of the most annoying cunts on the internet, okay? Now, you can say whatever you want about me. I don't give a Bruh. I'm a fat Bruh. that likes to diss people online and react to shit for a Bruh. living. Am I rich? No. But I don't care about being rich. I don't care about having the best body. I don't care about these things. But you clearly do. And it just backfires on you. Every single time you post a shitty tweet or you post something, you have to post so many tweets because you no longer have your YouTube channel that was so good at the start. You are a Bruh. loser. Now, Sneeko viewers, you can do one thing. Okay, you can hate on me as much as you want in the comments and drive my video up into the algorithm. Or, okay, you can have a reasonable debate on why you guys even watch this. I'm going to end this video by saying, uh, Clint's just defend the base. But, um, to the Sneeko fan base, um, I'm looking forward to, um, if, you know what I'm saying? If Sneeko does want to make a video, he can, oh, wait. I won't be watching because nobody has Rumble downloaded. <laughs> I cannot fuck with these niggas. I cannot fuck with these bitches. I'm trying to get my rest bigger.